As a practitioner, one of the choices we always have to make is what type of suspension we're going to use for a patient and their residual limb in order to hold the prosthesis on. And when we say suspension, we mean how is a prosthesis going to stay on my leg without falling off. And there's three main ways that we do this nowadays. One of the ways is to use a liner that has a pin lock here in the bottom and that ratchets on to a lock in the bottom of the prosthesis. And then when a person's walking, that holds a prosthesis on through that ratchet lock. Another way to hold on a prosthesis is through suction. That person would use a regular gel liner with just a cushion on the bottom. They'd descend into the prosthesis and then pull a sleeve up to their thigh and then there's a one-way valve built into the prosthesis and that's how it holds on is through suction. And it actually works so well that I can have a person sitting in a chair and pull them across the room with their leg and it's not going to pull the prosthesis off. So it works really well. Uh, even a, and one more step beyond that if a person has a really short residual limb or if there's any other uh, medical issues that we would consider vacuum, we can use um, a vacuum pump built into the pylon of the prosthesis and instead of just having suction, it kind of vacuums them down in there and locks the prosthesis onto the leg uh, with even more positive suspension. For more information or to ask us a question, visit beulabiotech.com.